Hello friends, welcome back. Our today's topic is probability. As we know, probability is one of the very important topic for any kind of exams. Let it be bank, SSC, UPSC, and the placement trainings. In all the exams, you can expect questions from the probability. And SPI will have more number of questions from the probability. You can expect even four to five questions from this topic. So our today's question are very important question. So let's start with the question number one and try to solve it. So a bag contains a uh, six white and four red balls three balls are drawn at random what is the probability that one ball is red and so this term plays an important role so one ball is red and the another two are white okay now this is a third type on the balls question so you can please watch the previous videos to understand the concept so how many total balls has been drawn three now if i'll talk about the total number of balls total number of balls will be 6 plus 4 which is nothing but 10 balls and we are going to draw 3 out of that now my probability will be equal to n e divided by n s standard formula where n s will be total outcome friends so where n s will be total outcomes and if we'll talk about n e then n e will be favorable n e will be favorable event right okay favorable outcomes now so what is total outcomes so total number of balls is 10 and we are going to draw we are going to select three balls out of that then one ball should be red see if you want one red ball then take from red so 4 c1 okay and so if in the question and is there then use multiplication sign and if question or is there then uh, then use addition sign so here it is and so use multiplication now another two has to be white so select from the white so 6 c2 now just calculate the value using the formula ncr where ncr will be equal to n factorial divided by r factorial into n minus r factorial so this will be the formula for ncr c4 c1 n c1 will be equal to n so 4 c1 will be equal to 4 6 c2 so 6 factorial divided by 2 factorial into 4 factorial 6 n factorial 2 r factorial n minus r 6 minus 2 is 4 factorial 6 factorial expand till the highest value in the denominator 2 factorial is 2 4 factorial 4 factorial cancel 2 3 is a that means this will be 15 divided by 10 c3 so 10 c3 means 10 factorial divided by 3 factorial into 7 factorial now 10 factorial will be 10 into 9 into 8 into 7 i will stop till here because in the denominator we have 7 factorial and 3 factorial will be 3 into 2 this and this got cancelled 3 3 times 2 4 times so 120 so 15 8 ja and 4 2 ja so 1 by 2 that means 50 percent is the probability so option a will become the correct answer for the question number one now moving towards the question number two question number two a box contains so all these questions are based on the balls so a box contains eight red seven blue and six green balls one ball is picked up randomly so here we are going to pick only one ball now if you calculate the total number of ball friends total number of balls will be what 8 plus 7 plus 6 so 8 plus 7 is 15 plus 6 is 21 so out of 21 balls you are going to draw one ball right okay so friends by seeing the answer only you can say you know options only you can say either d or e will be the answer because we are going to draw only one ball so 21 c1 will be nothing but equal to 21 so if you have to guess also you please guess into the option d and e okay now see uh, even option a can also be the answer in one case when when the above you are getting you know 14 and then 21 then you can say then you can say it will be 2 by 3 but this will be also not possible because you are going to draw only one ball so numerator also will not be equal to 14 let's see so probability is the one formula which we are using throughout the probability n e by n s so n s so total number of ball was 21 and you are going to draw one ball and now what has been told so what is the probability that it is neither red nor green so it is neither red and it is nor green 
सो डोंट टेक फ्रॉम रेड एंड डोंट टेक फ्रॉम ग्रीन डोंट टेक फ्रॉम रेड एंड डोंट टेक फ्रॉम ग्रीन सो वॉट विल बी दर सो सेलेक्ट फ्रॉम द ब्लू सो सेवन सी वन सेवन सी वन सेवन विल बी आई नो सेवन सी वन विल बी सेवन एंड ट्वेंटी वन सी वन विल बी ऑल्सो ट्वेंटी वन बिकॉज एन सी वन इज नथिंग बट इक्वल टू एन सो यू कैन सी द ऑप्शन डी सेवन बाई ट्वेंटी वन सो ऑप्शन डी विल बी द करेक्ट आंसर इफ वन बाई थ्री इज गिवन देन यू कैन देन यू कैन टिक दैट आंसर ऑल्सो बट इन दिस केस सेवन बाई ट्वेंटी वन आंसर is that right okay now i hope you understood both the questions and both the questions are very important so this was the question based on the balls in the next uh, videos we will be starting the questions with dias so dias is one of the important topic in probability and then uh, further after that we will be starting with the cards problem so thanks a lot for watching the video